could a computer ever read a human mind? By implanting electrodes into the brain, could it access our thoughts, hopes, and dreams? This may sound like a futuristic fantasy, but it's exactly what some scientists are trying to do. Using video game technology, they have developed a new way of moving through virtual reality by thought alone. Thomas Schreyer is paralyzed. He broke his neck in a freak holiday accident. I ran to the sea and jumped over the waves. And one of these waves uh, pushed my, my feet uh, up and uh, I crashed with my head on the bottom of the sea. Since the accident, Thomas has been unable to move his arms or legs. But thanks to a new European research project, he is learning to maneuver his way down a street, albeit a virtual street. The cap he is wearing is packed with sensors, which pick up electrical signals from the motor section of his brain and send them to a computer. When Thomas thinks about moving, the computer software translates the thought into a command. The harder he thinks, the stronger the signal becomes. When it's strong enough for the line to cross the red mark, Thomas moves down the street. Hello. And whenever he meets a virtual girl, he thinks himself to a stop. It was good to meet you. Has a virtual chat before moving on again. When I first suggested this idea of moving things by thought, and I wrote this in the proposal, people said, cut this out because this is crazy. People are gonna think you're mad, it's never gonna work. Bye. So it was very pleasing that the original so-called crazy idea actually works out. It was good to meet you. Moving in a virtual world is just the beginning. Researchers are confident that sooner or later, the same system will be used to propel Thomas's wheelchair down real streets. Nice to meet you. And give him back some of the freedom he has lost since the accident. Bye. But if a computer can translate human thoughts into actions, where might this technology lead? <laughs>